Oh, oh, we're recording. Whoops. Well, welcome back to another video, ladies and gentlemen. We are finally back. Yeah, it's been a while. So, yeah, I've been kind of taking a small little vacation. But, yeah, this is my kind of new house. It's a uh, old shipping container that I've built into my own house. And then I got those couches that fold out and become a bed. So, yeah, I really like it. I actually do like it, though. Got an office, you know, to play some farm sim. I'm currently in a map. I just took an evening nap, and it's raining. Close out that. Then I got TV going. And so, yeah. And then we have a special guest today. So, before I go any farther, I guess we'll let my special guest say hi. Say hi. You're good to go. Hi. So, yeah, that's my uh, friend. Look. Yeah, you're my friend. Anyway, so, yeah. So, I guess I'll show you what we own. We own this little pile of land. Oh, uh, I own that, my house, I own this trailer, 50 foot, I bought another trailer, and we're, we run a truck dealership. Now, I, before I show you my beautiful truck, if you've already seen it, I guess I'm going to shut the big door. Open the little door. I own a lot of things, I'm kind of rich, so yeah. So right here we have a limited edition, it's not actually a truck in real life. They, they are making a truck kind of similar, it's the T TRX. It's the Ram, I think, 1500 Rebel with a, it's actually a T a TRX, so yeah, it's got a Hellcat. But this is a 3500 long bed dually. We, we don't use it for towing unless it's a very small thing. But then it's got that, and it's got this package, and I really like it. And it's got hydraulics, front and rear, we're only going to use front. So yeah, that's what we're going to be driving today. Then we have my trusty old... Uh, 2006, by the way, that's 2020, by the way, er, that nah, by the way, but yeah, we have our 2006 Dodge, same one we have in the logging series, so if you recognize this one, all that's different is the color. Then over here we have my John Deere specially painted in, uh, metallic green, with a bucket, a grapple, a snowblower, and pilot force, so yeah. And I guess I better shut this door because I gotta go to work and I'll sh kind of show you around there. So before we leave, we're gonna put the hydraulics up and I'll kind of show you. So yeah, this has got the SRT kind of style, it's red interior. Okay, I'm gonna close that garage door and then I'll show you the rims. There's the, the rim. They are real bead locks. I repeat, real bead locks. At least that's what the manufacturer told me. The, I know the front's actual bead locks. I don't know about the back. So, yeah. And that's it. And then our guest would like to say something, so go ahead. Those are actual bead locks. I remember putting those on. Yeah, so he kind of purchased the truck for me. Yeah. I'm his, basically his worker. Yeah. I do a lot for him. He will be in this series eventually. Not right away, probably, though. Okay, now we're completely lowered. Lowered. Well, I guess we'll give it a speed test. Let's get our speed. Yeah, we'll do, we're just going to skip uh, our turn and go to Bill's house. You know how it is. Gotta yeah, get the bill. yeah, yeah, bill, 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 billboard. I do not know why I said that. I just talk a lot. Yeah, he likes to talk <laughs> about random stuff. In one minute, I'll be talking about. We get the point. Okay, I turned traffic off still. Yeah, while I was making this map, it took me a long time, I turned traffic off for a reason. Okay, so yeah, we're gonna get going. And in this map, the cars fly. They go 55, speed limit. 
But like our very first map that we played in for episode number one, this speed limit says two different. There's two different speed limits. There's 45 and 55. See, so yeah, as we come up, we'll be coming. Oh, 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 shoot, I missed our turn. <laughs> you know how that is. Lag, I was like. See, as we pull in, I guess you guys already see kind of stuff. Oh, I guess our uh, workers out are here, our uh, mechanic. Good for him. <laughs> Get this thing looking all purdy. Throw the front bags up. Bags up. Action. We're gonna, we're gonna do that or that. That looks best. So yeah, okay. So the next, we're gonna go over here and we're gonna look at our kind of our lineup. So yeah, today our mechanic got everything out for us. Typically we do that, but you know, yeah, you get the idea basically. So over here we have a 2018, we have three of these, they're Durangos, this one is a, basically just this thing, it's a SRT, the only difference between them really is the tint, one of them has a t window tinting, this one has stripes, and then there, one of them I believe has tow package, so yeah, there's, that's, they're very small, and then here's a 2016 Mega Cab 2500, uh, short bed, I mean, I guess it has to be short bed. It's got toolbox bed. Here's an 03. I think it's an 03. Hold on, we gotta gotta see the badging. No, it's 2016, I believe. Uh, 3500. It should have a sunroof. Yeah, sunroof. Both of them do. And then that one's. This is bone stock. Not even joking. Then we have a 2020. I mean, 2019. Hemi. Uh, 3500 heavy duty lariat cab. Then over here, we come back here, we have another 2019. This one's black, it's more of a work truck, it's got the Cummins, flatbed, all that good stuff. Over here, we have a 2014. Geez, so many trucks. We kind of specialize in more trucks. We got a 2014 with the kitted out. This was used as a work truck and was ended up being sold later on to us. Over here's a 2003, this is one of my favorites that we sell. Uh, it's got a custom move bumper. I don't know what that means. It's a long bed. It's got the dual exhaust like that. Looks pretty sick. And it's got the same bumper on the back. Over here, this is a second generation Dodge with the Hemi. That, I'm not exactly sure of the year. I just know it's second gen. So yeah, I think it's a second gen at least. I'm not really sure. We got this one in and we didn't know that much about it. Same with this blue one right here. This, they're the same truck, just that one's... They're a little different, motor-wise and stuff like that. Here's a Cummins single cab, 3500. We have this almost the exact same truck up there. Except this one's got a Cummins in it. Then we got our two Durangos. Now, this the only difference is this one's got a white tint. This one's got no tint. And then the interior... Or, no, this one's... Oh, and then this one has the TV... The... Uh, TVs in the back. Over here, here's the TRX that I was telling you guys about. I believe it's an R. Yeah, TRX. Now, this one's got the Baja package, I guess you could call it. So that. That's the meaning for those. Four-door. It's got roll cage. The other one's red. Same thing, though. Then over here, we got a 2016, I want to say. Ram 3500 Cummins. Got a light bar in the front. And yeah, so that's that. Then I guess we'll go open up, because, you know, we're kind of open. <laughs> First day. So, yeah. We'll kind of show around then here. So, in here, you already see, like, a bunch of cars. So, yeah. Open up. So, over here, we have a Hellcat with the yellow and black interior. You only find one of these. They're not real. Well, I don't believe so, at least. This is a Challenger. And it's got the Hellcat. And it's got John Deere green and John Deere yellow. So yeah, that's kind of idea. This is a bone stock Hellcat uh, charger. The only thing additional is the red interior, and it's got this little wing. 
Then over here we have something pretty new. The Grand Cherokee Supercharged, also known as the Trackhawk. So yeah, that's that. Oh, it's got tow package. Do not forget that tow package. Uh, then over here is just a bone stock charger, basically. Uh, I think it's this one's SRT. I think so, I don't know. Then over here we have basically the same truck that I have. My Hellcat truck. There's one other one, and we sell it. This one has slightly different rims, and it's the opposite of our colors. Then over here we have a special edition. This is a stainless steel black charger. I like it a lot. <laughs> then we have the basically the same one as over there, charger. We got a trail cat. There's a difference. This one's like a Wrangler with a Hellcat. They did make that apparently, according to the internet. Then here's a blue one. We have a red one out back, and then my one of my employees is leaving his here for a couple days. So yeah. Then over here we have a first gen, and we do not sell this first gen. It is strictly for show. So yeah. And then back here, we come. We should be able to open this. Door. Is this the door? Yes, it is. Okay, so I'll kind of show you. Oh, there's the door that our employee left on. So here's, there's the other TRX that I was telling you all about. Close that gigantic door. So over here's our company truck. This one and that one over there is. This is like a metallic or chrome kind of green. Custom built. We have a trailer that goes with that enclosed. And here's our service truck. My service truck to be exact. Over here is a truck that's being sold. We actually don't put it out because... It really just doesn't have good luck. We've had a lot of people comment and say, We don't like this, and this truck is so ugly. So, we just let people that want a custom off-road truck, that's kind of what we show them. Then over here, we have my employee's trail cat. And then here's the specially designed snow trail cat. Yeah! Kind of a mu little much, don't you think? So yeah, it's got chains. That's, all the, that's the only difference. So yeah, that's kind of that. Then we're going to take, I got to take to go get uh, another truck. We're going to take, we'll take this Challenger over here. Because it's pretty fast. We'll let that warm up. It's kind of been sitting in this cold place for a while now. So yeah, we might not get to it. I don't know. It depends how traffic is. If it's nice enough to let us go or if they're all going to be like, yeah. You, you, you get the idea, kind of. Okay, we're gonna shut this door. I'm gonna leave my sales manager up to the rest of this. Probably won't get anybody. We've only been open since Christmas. We literally just reopened. In game, in game, I repeat, in game. And then at the top it says early spring. We're calling it early spring. We've been shut down because of COVID. This is not really true, kind of. I mean, it is, but it isn't. So yeah, we're gonna take this and go at least show you guys. We're pulling out in front of this car. So yeah, this car, all the Challengers that are stock, are mostly stock, they're all actually originally police cars. This one we paint, that's why they all have that kind of weird looking stripe thing. So yeah, that's kind of the story behind these. And I'd like to show you guys what else we got, but we're looking to be almost out of time. So yeah, hopefully we can just... Get people to move. Casey's! Casey's, come here, Casey's. Oh, I'm sorry, Casey's. But I gotta show these people these cars. I mean, our truck. So, yeah, I'll basically just kind of spoil it really quickly. It's a rollback Ram 3500 power wagon. Or, I think it's actually just a power wagon. I'm not exactly sure. It's a special truck that we have specially made for us. Just so we can kind of do our thing because we do actually tow or not really, we kind of tow but we do repose for people that don't yeah <laughs> so that's it so yeah and then this is my trailer i bought this is my actual trailer for at my place so yeah this is it it's got this bright green i'll kind of show you so i can't hook up a trailer with it which is kind of sad so yeah that's that We have up, down. 
then we have that little back flap moves up and down. We're going to leave it up. And there's something else, and then we got this little brush guard. But yeah, anyway, ladies and gentlemen, that's going to be the end of the video. Thank you all for watching, and I hope you enjoyed.